I'm, I'm just able to travel, to travel the world and talk to the young people, speak to them, sing to them. And God has opened so many doors, not only for my music ministry, but for, for my preaching ministry as well. And I'm so excited when you had reached out to me and asked me to be on this call about real men, real talk. And automatically what I thought about is a real man in the Bible and his, his by, by the name of David. And many of the listeners may ask, why do you see David as a real man? Because when you think of David, he had so many flaws. And when I say flaws, he had deep, deep flaws, all the way from all the lives that he had to, to he, he killed. And, and even with his son, raped his daughter, Tamar, he, he didn't really do anything to son because he loved him so much because he was his firstborn. But when I think of David being a real man, is by every through everything that he went through, his his ups, his downs, everything that he did wrong, his heart toward God remained the same. And that's what made David a real man. Even even when he came to 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 be the king, he brought together the ten tribes of Israel. So when we think of David, David is also a unifier. Amen. And in the, the fact of the matter is David's son Solomon, when he when he came to, to be king, he was basically a spitting image of David. When you think about it, Solomon Solomon he had many wives and all of that different kind of stuff. But the, the difference was with Solomon's wives, Solomon Solomon's wives had introduced him to all of these other gods and he began to believe in all of these other gods and that's what made him different from his father. And what made David David being the man that he is, he pulled Solomon to the side. He said, hey, son, this is not what you need. This is not what's for you. He said, and, and, and the, the thing is, Solomon, all he had to do was, be, was have faith enough to be obedient enough to know that he is that, to be in the place that he is right now. He has to be man enough to be the king. And then and the fact of the matter is, what today, when we look at what's a man and, 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 and what's a boy, we, we think of age and different things like that. But when we look at life today, there are men living as boys and boys living as men and it has nothing to do with age it has it has so much 